Well, I started spray paint art. I saw somebody else do this about six or seven years ago at a local festival. And uh, I thought, well, that'd be interesting to do. I've done a lot of art before. So I thought I'd give it a try. Unfortunately, I didn't right then. I kind of put it off. Then I saw him about three years ago and uh, tried it again. And I thought, okay, this time I really need to try it. So I got a few pieces of poster board and some spray paint, which are the basic tools of uh, spray paint art and uh, tried it out and it kind of worked so I kept going. Uh, so I've been doing it for about two and a half years. Uh, this is the first time I've been at the celebration and it's, it's great. A lot of people here, which I love, it attracts a lot of people. Most people have not heard about spray paint art so it makes it even better because then they're really intrigued by what they see. Um, but I typically hit most uh, local festivals. I'm from central Illinois and most people, like I said, have never seen or heard of spray paint art unless you've been to Mexico or Las Vegas or someplace warm or just happen to see it. Um, basic tools that I use are generic glossy paint, poster board, newspaper, regular paper, use lids that help with some of the shapes, and then just manipulate some of the paint on the poster board and hopefully it comes out the way I'm, I'm wanting it to. So. I do have a website. My website is, let me say what it is first, Nathan Spray Monet. And it's N-A-T-H-A-N-S-S-P-R-A-Y M-O-N-A-Y. I know Monet is French and it's with an E-T, but it seemed to work really well with the A-Y that goes with spray. So, so I'm kind of the spray Monet of uh, spray paint art.